Hello and welcome back to Wind Vega. So we are in this uh, what's this place called? This can I see a name somewhere? I forgot it's something fortress or something. Uh, how do you check the map? What's it? Button checks the map again. I was supposed to like check a full map, wasn't there? But now I don't know what button does that. Huh. Do I not have the ability to do that here? Hmm, weird. Oh, whatever. Anyway, I don't know if it says the name, like... No, there gotta be a button. Um... Oh. Hmm. Does that red icon mean that guy? That's good to know, you can maybe check. Map for that. But like, what? there was a button, but I pressed every button, I... No, this control and I didn't see anything do anything, but I know there's a map you can check a big map. That's very weird. Like I don't know what button would do that suddenly. Anyway. But yeah. It's uh what we're doing. <laughs> what an odd start. Uh, anyway, basically uh we 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 sneaking about uh, I guess I can drop that. This thing about we are turning off the lights and yeah. Uh, I can go down there, I can maybe, yeah. Well, let me just see, see what's down here. Since there's a ladder, I don't, not too worried about not being able to go back up. Let's see if there's anything I need to do here. Oh, okay, this is this, yeah, box. Uh, okay, you grab the box with the R. Uh, that's right. <sighs> Alright. In case I need to go back later. I don't know. Watch out, this is constructed. Again, um... It's a little bit confusing, but it's also like, it's a, it's a circle, so I can just, you know, do the circle and it's be fine. Ah, uh, no. Do that. Sidle. Settle. How do you say that word? It's a weird word. But it's what we it's what we're doing. It's true. It takes a long time though. So. Hope I don't have to do that often. Nope, nope, I get to do it again. And I don't think there's anything below. Cool, what a challenge. Hold left. Or forward. It's uh certainly gameplay. <laughs> Like, yeah, this is not the strongest opening. Uh, glad there's an island before I had to do this, you know. Glad I can explore the island and have fun there, because... Oh, well, this is kind of... Eh, not what I'm here for, but, you know. Hey. It's the beginning. Uh, do you want to, you know, do something new? And I don't think... I mean, there's that, that, that one stealth section in uh, Ocarina, isn't there? I remember now, in the, in the hedge maze or whatever. Sort of kind of thing. It's kind of like this, but on a smaller scale. Like this is like pretty much a full dungeon, which also is kind of interesting. That's one of the first things you do in. The, I mean, there's kind of dungeons before this. Anyway, uh, I totally didn't even pass that. I got my sword back, but I got my sword back. Hooray! All right. So I. I don't know if I need to be stealthy anymore but to, since I have a weapon, but we'll see. We'll see how much that's left this to do anyway. Oh, hey. Well, we found Avil and some other people. <laughs> I don't know. Uh oh. Link, here's a thing. Oh, it's a big old bird. First boss. Uh oh. Well, so much for rescuing them. Oh, is that cannon? 
think so. Oh, is he getting the dolphin this one? I forgot which is which. <laughs> so... Maybe we'll see, yeah. Well... That was a huge waste of time. <laughs> we didn't get much accomplished. Now we are floating in the ocean. Got a rescue from mysterious boat. Link! Link! Wake up, Link! Okay, I'm not gonna keep doing that. Probably starts to get a link. Here's the boat. The red boat thing guy thing. Well, I've come to since yet. Whoa, it's talking to us. That's crazy. That's the sad thing about knowing a decent amount of stuff about this game. I mean, I guess this is not the biggest reveal, I'm pretty sure this was in the trails too and such, I'm sure, but, you know, still. Uh, yeah. The bot talks. <laughs> you are surprised, don't wait! Ah! Ah! Delayed reaction. <laughs> Did I startle you? A spell that is only natural, as wide as the world is. I am the only boat upon it who can speak the words of men. I am the king of red lions. Do not fear, I am not your enemy. Link. I have been watching you since you went to the Forsaken Fortress, that's its name, to rescue your sister. I understand how your desire to protect your sister could give you the courage to feel to stand up to anything. But such a bold attempt was foolhardy. I suppose you saw him, the shadow that commands that monstrous bird. His name is Ganon. Not Ganon, Dolph in this one. I, I I don't remember what the difference is. Why sometimes it's Ganon and Ganon, Dolph and all that. But anyway, he who obtained the power of the gods, attempted to cover the land in darkness, and was ultimately sealed away by the very power he hoped to command. He's the very same Ganon, the emperor of a dark realm. Uh, of the dark realm, the ancient legend speed of, speak of. <clears throat> I do not know why the seal of the gods has failed, but now again has returned, the world is once again being threatened by his evil magic. Certainly. Do you still wish to save your sister from him? Yes. And will you do anything to save her? Yes, yes. I see. In that case, I should guide you as we go forward, advising you on what you should do and where you must go. Okay, can cannot be very free. Be defeated by human hands, let alone by what little strength you possess. Oh, well, guess I'm screwed. The key to defeating that cannon is locked away in a great power that you can wield only after much toil and hardship. Do you understand? Mm, sure. In that case, we depart to the Great Sea! Ah, but I'm getting ahead of myself. This is actually a bit embarrassing for me to admit, but all I need a boat that possesses the power of speech, uh, I possess no sail. And a boat with no sail can sail no seas. Well, you could row it instead with, with, with an oar or something, maybe? But, I don't know, maybe you're too heavy, I don't know how it works. I don't know, boats. Anyway, <laughs> I have brought you far to the east of the dark gaze of the Forsaken Fortress. On this island is a town of merchants who deal in a wide variety of goods. If you search hard enough, surely you can find one who will sell you a sail. I'm sorry to ask this of you, but without a sail, I will be useful to you. So, how did you get from the ocean to here without a sail? Is that explained? Or, I don't know. Anyway, the island of merchants is my is home to many valuable goods. But a sail must come first. Do not feel limited to buying only it. Once you have it, feel free to stock up on anything else you think you might need. But remember, there is no time to play. 
Come back here immediately as soon as your errands are done. Don't tell them what to do. Boat! I'm Link. I do what I want. Well, I got a sword still, so that's good. Yeah. Hi. Speaking to you in the water, I guess. Did you get a sail? Oh, it's time to lose! You must find one quickly. Alright. Still trying to figure out. What? How do I. I know that is a button that gives me map, but. I thought it was down though. I I'm genuinely confused. I'm sure there was some kind of way to get a full map, but I don't know. It's so weird. I thought it was down or up. I don't know. Doesn't matter. I have this map. It's fine. It'll do. Uh, what's the matter, Mister? Why are you looking at us like we're aliens or something weird like that? What? We're good girls, we don't spread rumors. Speaking of the map, I did look it up and it apparently just looks like this. <laughs> Weirdly crappy. I don't know, but it's fine. It'll do the job. What? Can't you see we're busy? I know we're super cute and all, but that doesn't mean you can just come up and talk to us whenever you like. Jeepers. Alright. Uh, well, maybe we talk twice because sometimes. Why are you staring at us like that? Huh? I know we're cute, but we're good girls. We don't know any rumors, and we don't spread once we know. Don't know whatever you said. Yeah, we're good. No matter how much money you give us, we won't tell you anything. Nope, nothing. That's right, not even for two rubies. Yeah, some rubies. Oh, really? You're gonna give us rubies? Yippee! We get one whole ruby. We each get one whole ruby. Yeah, okay. <coughs> we're still not gonna tell you anything. Not even a teensy tiny rumor. No. Yeah, we would never tell you about the jars hidden in the grass clumps around the town. No chance, our lips are sealed. Jars hidden in the grass. Uh huh. That's what we're talking about. Hi. So, I'm feeling pretty good. Why? Because I really think I'm myself a pet pig. Free, in fact, I got a blind spot pig too. After you see one of those, not up and jump. I I flipped them a shot to grace our yonder, but the thing is, I can't stop worrying about the little guys. Hey, did you know if you ever have money, I give good financial advice. Hey, you come talk to me anytime, John. I may not look rich, but I got plenty of cash. Okay. Well, I mean, okay. I think I know what this house is. Is this not the house with the bombs? I think this is the house where you get bombs. Yeah, 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 yeah. There is this specific memory I have of this game where there's like a few things that I remember explicitly. For some reason I remember there's bombs there. This better be the. Uh, this, this will be the bomb shop. Go on, use that to look around. Um, that's quite a spanking stuff. <laughs> My ancestors has been making bombs for the innovations, uh huh. Now, it seems like we're the only. Uh, like, I'm the only person in the world who still works in the bomb industry. Well, you're not gonna be around for long, because I don't think many people will buy a bomb for 10,000 rubies, but whatever. Which means I'm the best in the world, and. Which means I don't go selling my work without approving to. who I sell to. And I don't approve you, so read it. Mm. Alright, well, can't buy the meat if I wanted to because uh, way too expensive. They were gonna get that amount of money. But hey, I assume there's another way. For instance, going behind maybe. I remember this being a thing, but I don't know if I can even do this yet. But going behind mm, does have a purpose, I'm pretty sure. Oh, oh, fall. Can I cut this? Okay, yeah, hmm. Alright. Well, get some rubies right now. Can I climb that? I can, actually. Cool. And, uh, crouch. I don't know if there's something I can do yet, but as I know, yeah, I knew there was something you could do if you go behind. 
Oh, we can't use the... The sword. Okay, well, some things give more than just one ruby, so maybe I do want to throw things occasionally. Because you know, like right now... Hmm, maybe this is just nothing. How do you think in there? You little rat, shoot, beat it, scram, ramen! Okay, maybe... It wasn't actually anything at all. Maybe it's for later though. I, I, there's some other reason I feel like you want to go back there. Uh, I'm not sure if we missed anything. Oh, there's some parts there. Oh, that's fine, I don't need to break those. Um, hi there. Oh, oh, if you please, young boy, dear, please help me. Please listen to my telephone. Yeah, okay. Oh, oh, my sweet, sweet daughter, my only daughter, poor oh, Maggie. She was captured by a bunch of villains and taken to the Forsaken Fortress. What on earth could those scoundrels want with her? Are they just roaming around looking for young maidens? Are they just steel creatures who delight in mischief? Well, crap. Having a kidnapped daughter doesn't get you a single ruby, you know? Please, please, save my poor daughter, I beg you. Here I stand, begging. Hope you give those scandals in the first thing for a good scare. Do you pay for what you've done? Oh, yes, pay. Young boy, oh brave young boy who promised to rescue my daughter Maggie. Hurry, you must hurry, you can't throttle. I'm so worried about my daughter, I can't even sleep at night. Please, whatever you can do. Anything, I beg you. I plead you, please, I'm counting on you. Alright. Hi. It's a peaceful place, this here island. The people here would never even dream of leaving their little paradise and settling and setting sail on the wise to sea, you know what I mean? Why well, this town is full of visitors that don't even show the slightest interest in sales of ship. Are we sailors the only ones? There's no one else set out on the great sea. Uh right. No box. Don't think I have anything. Good morning. Welcome to the island for the service. What do you have for the blah 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 blah? Nothing. Hello. You say you want to self when self a boat? Tell me you're kidding. T tell me you're kidding kidding with me. Okay, listen up lady, try using your head a little more. What make you think a blow like me, a guy who makes his living at the sea would give away a very sailing gear he needs to survive? Look somewhere else, laddie. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, right, yeah, right. If you could indulge me for a moment, please admit that I'm looking fine. Why looking this fine would have won me the Miss Windfall crown way back when. I'm still looking better than all the younger girls I know. Ho ho ho! Ho ho ho! And how do I look today? Okay. Anyway. What's in this building? Hello, hello! And hello! You are standing in the one and only Chew Jelly Juice Shop. Right. It was a bird. My post is not the best, I'm telling you. This is too good, in fact. They're absolutely incredible. Hmm, what's that? What's Chew Jelly? You ask? Looking somewhat revealing? Oh, sir, you simply must be joking. You don't know what Chew Jelly is? Well, just ask yourself this, good sir. What is a uh, robustly nosing element? What is a mystical substance that is good for the body and mind? Ask yourself. The words you jelly raw out in answer to these questions proclaiming themselves to be true. Why it is the key ingredient in the most efficient potions around. All you have to do is bring me an empty bottle to my little juice up here and I'll let you have a taste. Which begs the question, sir. And do you have an empty bottle? No. I don't. Yeah. Well, can't buy that. Uh, right, okay. It's like, wait, can I buy it? 
No, I can't. Alright. And there's stuff up there. Yeah. Give me your rubies. Bye. I'm Link. I break things in your house and then just leave. That's kind of my thing. Alright, well. Gotta, gotta go back there when I get that bottle, I guess. What's in here? Tempting. It's very tempting. No? Yeah, I'm surprised. Maybe saw it? Oh. You little weasel! Well, thank you so much for coming into my home and breaking my high price faces. If you break any more, I assure you that I shall not let it go slightly. No, sir, not at all. I require compensation. Okay. Bye. I don't want to pay you. <laughs> I remember something about that, but I don't know if there's any point to it, or if literally just have to pay him and I don't want that right now. Like, not with this much money. Well, I don't know if it's this much money, but it's a decent amount of money and I do need that sale, right? So, yeah, if I need to buy it, I don't want to <laughs> have to farm for anything right now. I don't know if this is how it works. Anyway, whatever. Looking for sale? I have no idea what, where to find one. Do I look like sense to you? Look, I'm feeling down right now, so shut up, will you? Drop anchor elsewhere. You're looking for sale? Okay. Well, let's go up here. Just looking everywhere. For fun. Hi. Yep, the sales like us to win our whole life. It would sure be nice if a fair wind blew today. Hmm. It's obviously wind that's blowing now. If you were to sail where this wind would take you, you end up on a straight shot to Dragon Roost Island. But I suppose telling that to a non sailor like yourself is a bit pointless, eh? Uh, what do you say exactly? I guess maybe a useful. Hint I should keep note of. Westernly wind. Okay. So from this island you want to go west to get to that island. Maybe that's important for later. Hi. What are you looking at, bud? <laughs> oh, hey, bud, what are, what are you? Some kind of country rule? I mean, look at that outfit. What a get up! This town is our turf. The turf of the world. Famous killer bees. Stop messing with us. Yay! Yeah, buzz, buzz. Hell, Lona, what? You must feel pretty lonely walking around in a place all by yourself. Uh, what are you doing anyway? You stink, mister. I ain't seen your face around here before, but. Uh, are you thinking something? Yay! Hey, it's just cause you're old. I don't think it makes you tough for anything. Why are you looking so sad? You think it's fun to go walking through town looking all pathetic? You think that makes you a big man? I hate these kids. <laughs> you look like a goody two shoes. When we hate goody two shoes, you can't go walking around our town pretending to be all big. How much did these people have to say? Okay, I think... I think it's... I'm unclear, but I'm pretty sure most people only have two things to say. No, no, go, go, go down. Go down. Oi. Well, you kinda wish you had a dedicated jump button instead of having to rely on the climbing and all that. It's kinda... You know... Uh, it, it's, it's, it's a thing. <laughs> I feel like Zelda games... Took a little too long to like get rid of, but whatever. Hi, welcome to Mrs. Marie's School of Joy. I don't think I've ever seen your face on here before, my young scholar. Are you a new pupil? What can I do for you on this fine day? We need to talk. <laughs> Apparently, 
I know I may look a bit flashy for a teacher, but I assure you I am one. How long has it been since I opened my school here on Windfall Island? 20 years? Ever since then I've been teaching the children of this island about true joy. But I do have a rather joyless problem. That's this delinquent gang of four young boys who never listen to a word I say. Even though I wait patiently for those boys to show up, they never come. It's as if they don't want to join their hearts. Could you please catch a leader that little boy named Naiman and talk into him for me? Please, Yang Yang? For me? Yes, ma'am. Oh, thank you so much. You're such a dear. These such troublesome little boys. I'm at my wits end over here and how's that But they won't be so mean to a boy that only is probably. Nice to think, though. Good luck, young man. Uh, okay, same thing, I think. Uh, yeah, okay. Right, yeah. If you hold the B, it goes a little fast, I think. Good to know. Alright. I'm guessing you're Iman, maybe? Yeah! Yeah, bud, you got a problem with us killing bees, huh, did ya? Talk to him with that annoying hack of a teacher again. It's a. Give me to give us a talking to, cause Mrs. Marie asked you to, right? <laughs> Tell us not to school, right, but Not to be tardy, right, but Well, forget about all that. We're the mighty invisible gang of four to kill a bees. Do you think we'll listen to a chump like you? I'll tell you what, but if you want to challenge to a competition, then we'll maybe then we'll think about maybe listening a little bit. What do you say, bud? Do you want to challenge us? I'll take you on. Okay, you you know, but the rules are simple. We're gonna go hide somewhere, and if you find us, we're gonna run. Gotta try to catch us. Easy said, but We won't hide indoors or nothing, and we won't leave this island. So look for us around in the shadows and behind buildings and stuff. Guess how fast we lose. You got it? Go! Alright. I don't think that's the time limit. I think I just do whatever I want, maybe. Because uh, I'm not gonna kill looking for them by the way. Um, did they go in here? Alright, that's the. Alright, okay. Then go in here, I don't think. Let's see what this is all about. Oh, yeah, you. <laughs> I know this. Hey, welcome. It's time to put game for kids. You wanna play a while? Yeah! Yeah, okay. Then, uh, um, I'm not gonna do an accent. Welcome to the fleet. I am the great admiral, Dolvalski, look sharp for me and see so protect us of this island. Admiral, red alert, all hands on deck. Someone shows that schools of deadly giant squid are approaching. All ships prepare for battle. What? Where? Ah, oh, I see. Sifin's approach. See, three squid groups. The last one, the medium one, and the small one. If we allow them to come any closer, the children on the island will be in great danger. So I'll take command of our new radar system and seek out and sing all this. All the seas, fiendishly hidden enemies. But be warned. If only 24 cannonballs you can fire. Destroy some moderating set parts, you must call for the wrecked hits and the large. Uh, three on the medium and two on the small. Use that to one fire. Maybe two. That's all. Yeah, aye, sir. Excellent! So far, our best sailor has managed to destroy all of the giant squid only using 10, 20 chunk cannonballs. May fight as bravely. So, this, this is basically battleships. <laughs> so, I only know what the strategy in battleships is. I, not something I play often, but I think what you typically want to do is kind of like not. I kind of go in, in the middle area rather than in corners and such. I don't know. Oh, okay, that was one too. Uh, so, 
there's a two, a three, and a four, so Kaboom! I can't be at both up and down. Splish. Okay. Kaboom! Okay, it can be both ways. Splish. Okay, it's Kaboom! these two then. Oh no! I right. They could also be a free. I didn't think about that. Splish. There's some strategy you can do, I guess. Splish. Like it needs to be a four, right? So Splish. up there could be here. Splish. Could be. Oh, well, I only have four left, so hopefully here. Splish. Nope. Oh, it could also be uh, all along this, I guess. Splish. Wow. Um, Splish. Ah, it was there. Dang! Oh, bad news though. Sailor enemies have retreated or something. Um, I don't know what happens if I win. It's not that expensive, so... Alright, so... Yeah. What I should do... Maybe... Uh, well... I don't know what the best strategy to do this is, but I'm sure there's a Kaboom! good way. I mean, it could be Splish. any which way. Yeah, it's just the worst way. <laughs> Great. Yeah, it, it is. It's basically a, quite a bit of luck. Alright, could be any which way. And what? Oh, I found all of them. Oh, that's nice. Well, <laughs> that's lucky. Excellent work, Sailor. Like your deeds have successfully protected the peace on this island of Ireland. We're very proud of such. Sailor and Ireland would like to thank you, Sailor. <laughs> right. Oh, thank you, Mr. Sailor. Please take this piece of heart. Sign of our gratitude. You're so great. Well, I'm glad it does. Yummy piece of heart. I'll eat it. I don't know what to do with these. <laughs> Whoa, wait a sec. Eight, eight, 18? Hey, that's a new record. So, uh, you get this too. Oh, nice. Oh, I got a treasure chart. So, uh, thanks for playing and all that. And I can't tell you how much. How fun it's been for me, and uh, don't forget your umbrella or something in the way of the door. Umbrella. Uh, okay, here it is. Uh, this shot you sunk in treasure room, the C chat with up, and check your special charts with Y. Compare all the way in the left, and there's another one. Maybe I can't do it in doors? Because I don't have a map on the thing there, it seems either. I don't know how this whole map thing is. I'm, it's kind of confusing to me. Like, why did I have a map at some point, but now I don't? Like, huh? Like, you say, open the sea chat with up. I'm pressing up. Like, did something happen weirdly? Like, I don't know, like, why it's not doing it. Huh. I don't know if something weird happened with the emulator or controller while I was doing I don't, Maybe I should. I don't know. I, I'm confused. <laughs> Whatever, it doesn't matter right now. You know, this thing may look like a wind, but it's actually a wind powered Ferris wheel. It used to harness the wind's power to spin in a, in a quite nifty manner. But we rarely get a fable wind around here anymore, so it doesn't budge. I'm pretty sure it's not broken or anything, though, so if the wind blew in the right direction again, we just have to hit the power switch to get it moving. Hmm, it looks like a westerly wind is blowing now. Alright. Well, can't do anything about that right now, but. You know, it's, it should be pretty obvious what we do uh, when we have the option. Because, you know, the name of the game is Wind Vega. There's wind in the game. It's a mechanic. <laughs> Look, 
you know, I'm not gonna hide that I know certain things about the game that maybe if you were completely blind you wouldn't know, but I mean, it's not a big deal really. It's just, most, most of it is pretty obvious and we're gonna get to it relatively soon, I'm assuming, so whatever. Anyway, hmm, now I would, uh, I would have to say that I've never seen your face before, have I? Hmm, now intriguing, beguiling. I know it is a small town, but I found one. But I found one can rarely trust strangers. Where did you come from, young sir? I'm sorry, but the years have made me very. Once long ago, I went in a room out to a travel bar for a single night. The next dawn, my precious picture box was stolen. Tell me, young sir, why are good deeds so often. Repaired with cruelty, I spread kindness where I can, and still my box does not come back to me. It is a sad thing. May You may look like a child, but you can see why I cannot be assured of your youth. Be a good boy and be gone. Shoo, shoo! Oh. Well, okay. How about I talk to you again? <coughs> of course, I have countless picture boxes, but I do not want any of them stolen from me. I'm not gonna take it on a loss. Alright, well, I don't know what I can do about that right now, but, okay. That happened. <laughs> mm. Hi. Hey there, boy. Did you happen to see the post box down near the docks? Well, just so you know, you have one to send a letter, or you send it to them, and you put the thing in the thing. Yeah. Alright. For long, the Vito... Vito Postman. That's the... that's the species. Vito. Okay. Um... Come to deliver it to whoever you sent it to. It's having a fella, I tell you. Uh, did I talk to you twice? Oh. What if the Vito Postman has already come today? Alright. I always forget to... Talk to them twice somehow. I don't know. I gotta get that in my head because some games do it, sometimes some games don't. <clears throat> People from all over the world seem to be get together here on Windfall Island, all hoping to become successful merchants. I suppose you could say that this is the island where people and money come together. But you know what? Money is important, sure. But don't you think people need to open the house a little more? That what? I've been kicking around this crazy world for a long time, and I've learned to step and step the flowers along the way. Anyway. Cool. <laughs> I mean, hey, there's, you know, people you can talk to for fun, and some that actually do things. Like this guy. He seems important. <laughs> My story is a strange one. I came across cursed seas from a land far away, a land where the blizzards blow violently, uh, heading for this town called Windfall. But dear me, as I told all the terrible storm descended and tore my ship to bits, and mysteriously only that escaped without so much as a mark on it. From the looks of you, I would say you are a troll as well. Oh, yes, indeed. You didn't purchase that for me? So uh, it, it is my one and only heirloom from home. The people of this town do not seem the least bit interested in that, despite the fact that it would help them travel the dangerous seas about the town. Please, I beg of you. I wish to hold my best to see in town, so I am in desperate need of fire analysis. How does 80 rupees sound? I don't need that. Oh dear me, sadly, I have nothing else I could possibly sell you. I have not but my hoodie coat and it is a keepsake for my dear dear mother all right i'll buy the thing sure yes 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 thank you very much indeed i have received precisely the rubles for it i can use these funds to finance my new business so oh, dear me what a happy day very well young master as i promised please take that i got a boat sale Set it to the and while in boat, you sail across the sea. Yep, got it. Alright. Yes, yes, yes. You have made a good purchase today, my young master. And you have saved my life and business as well. To say it dearly, it is the finest sail in the world. Tweet is as such. Windfall is a warm and bustling place, I deem. Can you believe I shall settle and open my business here? Yes, just as I was planning. 
Oh yes, I must say, if you happen to come across a delivery bag that looks handy for carrying products, let me know. The first thing I must do is find products to sell. Well, don't I have one? Oh, is it? No, that's not a button that does that. That's the menu button. Uh, I have a spot bag and a bait bag. I guess that's not the same thing then. Uh, set that to C. What's the C button again? That's the C button. Sure. I can do this. It's saying I never know anything. As I figure. Yeah. Right now my up is not working at all. I can't go into first person. Why? Why? That's just an odd thing. Because every other button works fine. It's just like yeah, even my left and right on D-pad works and all that. Like, but. What an odd... Why? Why did that suddenly happen? Odd, I, I, I guess I gotta figure it out for next time because I may need that. I, I mean, it's not a big deal. But yeah, maybe odd. It just... Because I can't even go into first person. It just up doesn't do anything right now. So what an odd little... Huh. Um, Big these parts. Get money. You look like a curious little boy. Did you know there's an island a little to the east of here called Vagnaloos Island? Wait, wasn't it west before? Or I, uh, whatever. Folks say that the island is the home of a tribe of people who dance in the skies like birds on the wind. They call themselves the Vito, and they say a sky spirit lives there, right? But uh, someone like me, a person who's never left this little island, it may as well be a fairy tale out of tale from a child's book. Not children's book, child's book. Whatever. Same thing, I guess. Oh, if only I had my own boat. Dragon Moose Island. Uh, sure, lots to go there someday. Uh, yeah, right. Uh, yeah, mm hmm. Right. Yep. Okay. Uh, do I talk to these people? She's so saucy, isn't she? Can't believe she's a school teacher. Who matters that she has mountains of techie, pendants, and earrings? It's as if she loves nothing in the world more than jewelry. Hmm? Now, just what are you doing? Are you listening to us, you scrap, scamp, scamp? S not scrap, whatever. Doesn't matter. <laughs> you listen, young man, I, have, I haven't seen you around, so I guess you need to windfall. But don't you know it's bad to each other in conversations when only for adult ears? We're discussing very, very important stuff that kids just wouldn't understand. Far too young to be listening to us, young man. So sure. Wow. Well. Jeez. Alright. Well. Uh, did I talk to you? Yeah, I did talk to you. Uh. Alright, I think I've seen everything? I guess I should go look for the kids that have been hiding. Wait, no, I haven't been here, have I? Oh no, no. Uh, I don't think I went here. <laughs> oh, this is on top of here. Okay. Hello. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder. I wonder if a boy like you will do. It's difficult to tell. Yeah, it's difficult. You'll see, my one and only daughter, Mil, I was taken away from me f to a frightening place called the Forsaken Fortress. I've asked many to rescue her, but it seems to be a difficult voice to let go of place. Oh, to see my sweet Mila again, my precious little daughter. I worry so much over her welfare. I can't recall the last time I've slept more than a wink. I sincerely wonder about the wisdom of asking a boy like you to do this. But will you lend me a hand to help rescue my precious daughter? Yeah, sure. I assure you, if you do rescue her, I will pay you. I'm as it takes. I keep my entire fortune for safety. Well, what do you think of the chances for my daughter's rescue? They say the place is called a forsaken forest. Go now, my daughter Mila, wait for a hero. Mm, what is it? You look like you want something. Don't tell me you need some fun to get started. Uh, yes, I do. 
You do want money. Oh, is that a fact? Money, huh? In that case... I must first test your resolve. Took a while, so... You know... Load, or whatever. Uh, okay. I can see you placed red rubies in three of the races downstairs, so which way is it in? Well, I think... Like... I saw them in, in, in the corners and one in the middle. So... Can I get down from here? Okay, maybe I can. Uh, let, let, let go. But I don't know which side I was on. I didn't... I don't think I saw any clues of that regard. Uh, well, it's not in that one, so it's probably... In this? Yeah. Uh, no. Okay, there we go. And... No. Just... Die. And I think... Maybe it's on... Okay. Um... Well, I, I got them. Wait just one moment! Do you think you can just break someone's vessels and leave without paying for them? I must chortle at your naivete. Ha <laughs> ha. Those happen to be extremely high class bone, bone china vases that run a minimum of 10 rubies each. Most assuredly. I shall now accept compensation for them. Let me see. Now that comes to a total of um, 40 rubies. So accept your payment. Uh, well, the red ones, what were they worth again? 20? So I guess I still made a profit. Right? Whatever. I don't really care anyway. When you make someone else's vases, it's only natural that you compensate them for the loss. You, my boy, are in the wrong. Are in the wrong. Are in the wrong because of your destructive tomfoolery. I mean, you were the one who put them there. What? Well, yeah, jeez. It's a scam, isn't it? Now, because of you, I'm going to be even richer, and I was quite rich before. It was a cool place, isn't it? Don't stand around looking like you've been swindled. Well, I mean, be on your way. Kinda have, but I, f I think the red ones are worth 20. I could be wrong, I don't remember the amount each one of them gives. But I think so, so I did earn money there, so... Mm. Uh, anyway, I'm a, yeah. Uh, okay, yeah. Uh, look around, gotta look around for the hits. Not exactly, exactly sure how they hide, if they're gonna be obvious to find, but... It's something I wanna do before I leave the island. Yeah, I'm, I'm choosing to go a little long this episode because... I wanna do this whole island and I think I can do that in, like, about an hour. Uh, I didn't go here before, did I? Oh yeah, I know this... This fella. This dancing fella. Oh no, that's not it, that's just not it! And the problem is, even though that's not it, this isn't it either! Extremist mark. Oh dear, pardon me, pardon me, guy! I was so fully and really absorbed in my dance that I didn't even notice little old you standing there. I am Todd. I think that's how you say that, maybe. <laughs> kind of weird name. Uh, anyway, I love dancing more than I love three meals a day. You will come to know me as the world's charismatic dancer extraordinaire. Wait. Ready, guy? One, two, one, two. Say, guy, you know what I was just reminded of? Long ago I met this delightful little guy who performed the most dazzling magic dance. Dance that turned night into day right before my very eyes. <coughs> I can remember those fabulous dance moves, but I can't I just can't seem to get that intrinsic rhythm down. Do you think you know the rhythm guy? No. <laughs> I don't think Link is much of a dancer. Magical dance that changes day into night and night into day. Uh, yeah, right. Oh, hi. Alright. 
uh, I would like to go after you, but cutscene. That's why I had to wait for so long. Uh, eh, get down there. Uh, so how do I catch you? Oh, just like that, I guess. Yeah, you got me. You ain't nice. I think maybe one of them is behind here. Like, wait, that's why I want to go back here. Uh, eh, no, 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 sidle. Ugh. Could be in a very specific spot. Like, position is not <laughs> this game's strong suit so far. I've se I've noticed. Like, you gotta be very careful in your moves. Oh, yeah, that's a good there. But so, get some more rubies, maybe. Yeah. Hi. Can I skip this? I don't really care to see that. What all? Take some movies, why not? Get over here. Get over here. I don't know if I need to hit a button or what. I guess it just kind of happened last time. Nope, not. Nah, dang it. I was trying to roll. Oh, curses. Get, get over here. I don't know if rolling faster. You know, it, it's gotta be faster. I think I'm catching up by doing that. Okay, you just gotta, yeah, get close and, yeah. Oh, lame. Two down, two to go. Not sure where the rest are, though. Gonna look all around the place. So, in there. Is that what you meant by the pots and the bush or something? What you said before? Maybe. Uh, hmm. Not a lot of room to hide in this place, I feel like. I'm gonna find them. No, nope, don't. Stop climbing things I don't want you to climb. That's gonna be a thing this game, I can tell. Can I. Is there anything I can get to from here? No, not really. Hmm. Looking around, don't see any kits. Don't think I went up here though. Well, let's check what this is all about. Yeah, this is gonna be a long episode, but it's fine. I, I feel like I should complete this area for some reason, I don't know why, I just... I feel like, uh... I don't know. Uh, I don't know, it's just what I feel like doing. <laughs> so be it. Welcome! Oh my, you're a very small customer, aren't you? Well, that's fine, of course. You just feel free to look around. Well, what do you have for sale? Oh, can I help you with something? Let's talk. When night falls around here, this place fills up with all these sour, swarthy sailors. I don't know how you say that, but... Yeah. In fact, there's this little book called the Shop Ship. It shows up at night and cruises around the island selling things. Uh, I'm not sure what the story is with that. Guess what I'm trying to tell you here is that this town has two faces. The nice pretty one you see in the day and the dark and shady one you see in the night. But I suppose that's too heavy because if you're something like yourself away. Why are people so condescending to me? It's because I'm a child. I mean... I do, I do look like I'm in a fairy tale, which, I mean, I guess I am, so checks out, but still. <laughs> anyway, lately I've been hearing that monsters from the Forsaken Fortress have been coming around kidnapping girls with long ears. I can believe it. Eh? After all, two girls from Windfall have probably been kidnapped. Poor Maggie and Mila. Just breaks my heart to think about those two. Both of their fathers are desperate to find anyone who can rescue their poor little girls. What kind of world has this become? So much fear and suffering. Oh, the horribleness! I don't know what I'd do if I were, if I were coming to the Forsaken Fortress. Just a thought of it since your time is fine. Alright. Well. So, things change when it becomes night, huh? Well, it's been day so far. I'm not sure how long it takes. Like. I don't see any clock or anything in this game, so... 
Maybe that's something you can get later, or I don't know, but like, you know, sun is shining. Alright, two kits, gotta find two kits. Okay, where could they be? Uh, where, where am I suddenly looking before? I don't know. Uh, yeah, you. Not hiding anyone. I went here. Huh. So they're not indoors. I know that. And they are not off the island. So I should be able to find them, right? I mean, how can it be? Yeah. Um, oh, there's a kid there. Yeah. Oh, okay. So can be in crazy places like that. Can I? How do I get it down? Nope. Don't mind. Nope. Yeah, that's fine. I don't care. Like, okay, there we go. I thought I rolled into it. Alright. Yep. Nope. Might you going somewhere? Ah. Stupid bush. Getting stuck in the bush of all things. No. Alright. Come on. Get here. Get away. Get. Gotcha. Yeah, he got me. Nope. I didn't mean to talk to you. No way! Uh, yeah, no. Missing one, huh? So, you can be in a tree of all things, so I guess I should... Yeah, maybe look around like this a little bit and... See if the uh, high and low and all that. One more to go now. I'm getting there. Easier than I thought it was gonna be, but also the last one may be a problem. I don't really know where to start looking. Uh, nope. Uh, oh, look in your eyes. So you find yourself a self, have you? Hey, well, and I shall teach you the out of say. I. Yeah. Right. No. Yeah. Right. Yes. Uh, there's a wind. As far as the thing, the dingy, thingy, my ding, what is it called? The, the chevron arrow thing? What is it called? M yeah, whatever. Uh, <laughs> probably like I get so caught up on that anyway. Uh, that appears behind me in the case, wind direction. I, 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 I'm not ready for this. I don't, I wasn't intending to talk to you. It's just, uh, if you wish to move quickly, you should keep the wind blowing directly into your sail. You can always press A to put away the sail. Try it when you want to adjust your speed, you know, and all that. Sure. One well, thing, when you're out and see where you let my by, you will be at the mercy of your sea chart. Mark the place that you currently heading on your sea chart. Right, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, the sea chart is important if I want to look. I gotta figure out why I would suddenly decide not to do that. That's so weird. Not to let me use the D-pad like that. It's I don't know. Now it was the wind blows. I've been no, not 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 right now. I just wanted to see if there's anything over here. No, that's just nothingness. I want to roll, but I don't want to speak to you. Why is the roll button the same button that speaks to people? Yeah. Anyway, um, not sure if you could be in a bush like that. Kind of all been around this area though. I like, wonder if that's a clue. Like, hmm. Oh. Well, I didn't check. Like, I was a place I didn't check over here uh, above. Maybe I just want to make sure because I <laughs> don't really know. Uh, where he would be hiding at all. Get rubies for this time I go here though, that's nice. Uh, I don't, yeah, I don't see anyone up here, okay, well. Uh, no. I'm gonna go in here because I, maybe these be spawn and get some rubies right now? I don't know. <laughs> they do. They gave me like a few rubies, didn't they? I'm not sure if this is worth my time. Eh, not really. 
Oh, the blue one. Mm -hmm, this, you know. I feel like there's another thing you need you can do with that guy here yeah, or something, but maybe not. Maybe it's for later. Uh, yeah. Where, where are you, last kid? Where are you? Like, do you like go to a rock or something like this? Like, I can't climb it. I don't think so. I don't know. Okay, let's get up here. Oh, come on, really? Okay, here we go. Jeez. Um, hmm. Where are you? I feel like I checked everywhere. Rolling to all the trees. In case you fall down. Check it over here. Something here. Did I? No, I didn't go. I didn't. No, I didn't. Yeah. Pretty sure I haven't been here. Though, this may be inside. Unless a button. Guess I'll step on that. Oh, okay. That makes that go. Maybe? No. Not quite. Uh. Can't jump to there, that, that ledge there, I don't think. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Oh. That's. What's there? Are you over here, maybe? Or. Where am I? See anyone? Oh, wait, there you are. Haha, -ha, found you. Alright, good stuff. Took a little longer than I wanted, but hey, I found some other stuff in the meanwhile, so not a bad thing. Uh, by the way, I just wanna see, like. Okay, that's right. Okay. I think there's nothing else up there. Run really weird. What's that run? Gotcha. You're awesome. Ah, uh, I can't believe it. You found all four of us, and you cut us all too. Talk about out of defeat. Looks like we lost our touch, killer bees. Eh, I guess maybe it's time we chilled out. From now on, we won't cause no more trouble for anyone. It's reward your hide and seeking skills. Here, take this, but. Oh, one more to go, and I get get a heart upgrade thingy, health container, whatever. You know what I mean. <laughs> uh, uh, this is a fatal possession, but you proved that you're worthy. To our bond, the hug and seek master. Oh, and one more thing, we need you to apologize to Miss Mrs. Marie Foss, All right, counting on you, but uh, where is that again? There we go. Has a face on the front, so it's easy to find. Alright, I think this is the last thing I'll do. I don't think there's anything else I can do. Maybe I missed one or two things, but, you know, hey. Can't do everything in the game. I don't plan to. I don't plan to 100% the game at all, but I'll do as much as I want to. And, uh, you know, hey, who knows how much I want to do at that point and when I finish it. So, you know, maybe I'll do a lot more than I expect. Maybe not. Who knows? Anyway. What can I do for you in this fine day? We need to talk. You did it, didn't you? You said something to those delinquents for me, didn't you, dear? 
Can't fool me, I watched it all from the shadow of my door. You really are, dear. You fill me with joy. I have to reward you, so here's a little spare change. Ooh, got 50. Nice. Ah, uh, and 200 is the limit, huh? Okay, good to know. Cause yeah, I think I had more than... Uh, I had like 160 or something. Alright. Oh, one more thing! Don't tell anybody, dear! What can I do for you on this fine day? Anything else? Cause tell them my eyes never deceive me. Someday, dear, you will grow to be a fine young man and your name will go down history. That's what I think, dear. Alright, is that it? I think that's it, huh? Alright, cool. Um. Oh. Hey, sounds like you apologize to the teach for us. Good old Mrs. Marie, and speaking of, uh, did you know it's gonna be Mrs. Marie's birthday soon? Boss, oh boss, I think maybe we should give her some kind of present or something. Don't be stupid, we're the killer bees, we ain't no teacher's pets. Yeah, but she loves jewelry and junk more than anything else in the world. What's she into these days? What's she call them? Joy pendants? Really? Where do you find them? Uh, are they just lying around? Mm, if we could just find them, we could give the cheese as a present and she'd be all happy. Hey, now that I think about it, when I was climbing trees the other day, I saw some sparkly light on, on top of some tree in town. What was that? Maybe that's one of them pendants. What do you think, boss? Nah, no, that's crazy talk. Don't I already have one? Uh, uh, yeah, uh, okay, same, yeah, okay, yeah, alright, right, now right. oh, jeez, I upgrade everything, <laughs> like, I think I have one, don't I, like, in my sparse bag, uh, how do you, there we go, yeah, I have one, I'm not sure how many I need, though, but, uh, I'm gonna, maybe, see if I can give that to her? Maybe. That's the thing I can do. Uh, what can I do in you? We need to talk. No? Uh, do I need to set this on something? Maybe? No. Oh, okay, there we go. Okay, you set the item. Okay, here we go. I see. My dear, that's a joy pendant! Tell the truth, I love jewelry above all else. And that, that, that why that is extremely rare and hard to come by. It's the hardest thing around, dear. Oh my yes, I'll happily take a single one from you. No, no, I insist, only one. Uh, to tell the truth, I actually like about 20 of them. <laughs> See if it's excellent, but okay. But that'll probably only have me in my vows of dreams. You know, I've been a teacher here for a long time. Tough to put one past me. That being said, I'm pretty sure I know who put you up to this, dear. Those little sweeties, I'm so joyful. It's the best birthday present I could ask for. I suppose I ought to thank you. Close your eyes, dear. What? Oh. Well, I mean, yeah. <laughs> Useless money. Whatever. It's fine. And if you see those boys again, tell them I say hello. Uh, oh, you're a fine young gentleman who gave me the job and then present. How could I forget? How many did you give me again? One? My, but what's that nice? So, what can I do for you, young man? Uh, pendant, volunteering kids. You have a lot to say, huh? <sighs> they didn't know this was gonna go on for this long. <laughs> uh, whatever. Although, I may be a school teacher, I have a certain flair about me, don't you think? And let me tell you, I loved you a little more than anything else in the world. Uh, wait, have I not only seen this? This is different. No. Oh, and why not? It's not like I can't afford it. Why have so much cash? I have my very own Oasis Cabana. But I happen to be after a very particular kind of jewelry. Right, yeah. Yeah, okay. Right, amazing. Come on, shape. Then you got them. Yep. Right. Uh, I mean, I, 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 gotta, I gotta say all the things, right? I gotta. Yeah. You know, I'm playing, playing for an hour now, so I'm a little bit exhausted, honestly, from, oh, from sitting for so long, you know. Don't typically sit for an hour at a time. <laughs> what else? Tell me, dear, do you know about the uh, Joyous Volunteer Association and the work to do? 
The suggestion is objective is to decorate our little town of info with flowers and other small decorative items to make our town a better, more joyous place. If you must know, the society came into being when the shop master Sunari, maybe, uh, Sunari, Sunari, I don't know, arrived here. He heard about my efforts to spend, to spread joy, and it moved deeply. <laughs> And so, is that, and is that nothing a poor, worthless person such as myself might do to make this a better place? And suddenly his eyes were opened. That's why I gave him a little advice. Do something that only you can do. Yes, that's what I told him there. It was after that that he began to show an interest in volunteer activities. He apparently came from a very cold place. But let me tell you something, despite his appearance, that one now is definitely one hard volunteer. He's the guy who sold the sale, I'm guessing. The kids. Seen that rascally gang of four walking around the plaza out there as if the owner plays, haven't you now? Apparently he came up with the most suitable name for that little gang, that's what I've heard. We be tough, we be bad, we be the toughest, baddest boss in town, yeah, we're the killer bees! It really went something like that. I guess they were looking for something of a fierce thing for themselves. This sort of fails spectacular, if you ask me. It must, it must be nice to be young. Alright, that's it, huh? Nope, not dang it. Nope, nope, not ah, uh, no, mm. Alright. Okay, well, that, <laughs> I guess I kind of want to see that Tsunami guy. Maybe he has something to say. Just in case. Like, I'm. You know, I know I'll, you just come back here later in the game, but uh, I kind of want to exhaust as much as I can right now, because I don't know when. So, yeah. Um. All right, the low bag. Okay, I guess you don't have anything else to say until I get that. Um, so apparently there was like a joy pen in one of the trees, but I don't see anything in any trees. So I'm not sure what tree you're talking about, but um, like yeah, I hit the tree. <laughs> so I mean, I think like they did like just drop by an enemy or something. So. I don't think I need to really worry that much about it if I want to get all 20. Are they going there? I don't remember going here. What is this place? Uh... Oh yeah, I've never been here. Oh. Can't use my sword in there. So weird, like... Well... Oh! Oh! Here you are! Alright. I've got you. I <laughs> the game so early. Yeah. Do, do I have to? Fine. <laughs> Alright. Hmm, I see the sanguine clothes and the sanguine hat. By the look of you, I say, so could you by chance be a fairy? Goodness! Did you feel my telepathy? That's why you saved me, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? Do not worry, Tingle knows without you telling him, sir. Yes, sir. Tingle, my name. I've been looking for you and your kind for I too long to be one of your f one of the fairy folk. And yet I was mistaken by for some kind of trouble man and put in this dreadful sort of place. <laughs> Disrespectful. Please, Mr. Fairy, rescue Paul Tingle from this place and take him to where you and your kind live in splendor. Luckily, I have no idea how to rescue you, so <laughs> that's not gonna happen. But if you help me, I'll give you a fabulous present. So, please, Mr. Fairy, please rescue your poor Tingle and take him to where you and your kind live in harmony. Again, I really don't know how to actually rescue you. Uh, so, yeah, right. Skip, skip. Yeah, okay. Yeah, why can't I skip this right now? I'm pressing the B and all that and not doing anything. Weird. Oh, there's a button. Oh, <laughs> it was easier than I thought. Dang it. Ah, well. Maybe it's worth it. <laughs> Something tells for start. Yeah. Hooray, thank you all so very much. Here is Tingle's heartfelt gift of thanks. Tingle, Tingle! Kulu Limpa! Become an item. What? <laughs> Gave you the Tingle sooner. Oh, right. Well, I kind of doubt I can do this in an emulator. I don't know if you can, but yeah. Um, 
That doesn't seem like a thing I can do, so... Yeah, whatever. <laughs> right, yeah. No matter how far we travel from this dingy cell, our sword will be as one. Splendid! Tinkle is going to get ready to go to the realm of the fairies, so you just wait here, okay, sir? Well, I mean, I assume this is purely optional, you know, because... I mean, <laughs> not everybody has a Game Boy Advance, right? So, you know. Anyway. Ah, I was forgetting something important. Oh, Mr. Fairy, you want to come to my island, don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Yeah. <laughs> I like how he also does it. You got Tingle Chat. Um, Tingle Chat. What kind of chat could it be? Uh, head out to sea and press the thing and yeah. You can, you can look at the thing. When you go to sea, oh man. Uh, oh, maybe you can't use the map unless you're on the sea. Maybe that's why it's not working right now. Could that be? Okay, maybe I should... Hmm, I don't know. I, I'm not sure if it's just... I don't know. Maybe it's, maybe it is intentional. I can't use the map and look at that right now. I don't know. It's kind of weird. So, no. No, but, but the, the, the first person didn't work, so I'm assuming it has to be some kind of emulator or controller in you. I don't know. Whatever. If you need any help with Charles, just leave it to Tingle. Don't ever forget. And this has been a very long episode now. I didn't even see this freaking door, and then all of this is happening. If you ever need help with Charles, don't forget. Can I go in there? Oh, hey. Uh, well, I don't actually need that, so I guess I'll leave it. I don't know, come back here likely, you know, like the old... Uh, no, god. No, jeez. Don't want to climb things. I wanted to see if I could move this. Uh, I'm stuck. Please. <laughs> yeah. Right. That's apparently a path here. Yeah. That, uh... I'm guessing he could have escaped from... Okay, well, this is kind of convoluted, like, what? I'm even going now. Well, I don't... I don't need the money. <laughs> Help, how do I get out of here? Uh... Where am I going, man? Oh, uh, hi. <laughs> well... <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, uh, yeah, that's kind of what I wanted, anyway. <laughs> Cause yeah, uh, uh, why is my? I thought I put the thing on the thing. So why isn't the thing on the thing? Uh, okay. No. Yeah. Now up works. So. We okay, so why is it just because I was on an island? Because now I can press up just fine, but then why? Then why? Because and now it works here. Wait, what? what? Why would it not work before? What an okay, let me. Oh, but now it's not going into first, but... But now pressing up isn't going into first person, like the button says there on the side. What? What is going on? What is... It? Why can I not go into first person mode right now when it's saying that... But it goes into the map instead. I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't I don't know, know but apparently I don't know. Uh, I I I'm I'm confused but I, I guess at least it works now, so that's good. <laughs> it, it's just I mean I don't need to go into first person because well I have to you know this in case I need to look around. But like yeah. So it's such an odd little I don't know why that would be how it works. 
But anyway, um, so that was, that was a long episode, double sized, but uh, I thought it was worth, you know, looking all around the island. And, and again, I may have missed a thing or two because apparently I almost missed Tinkle, <laughs> which would have been nice anyway, because it's Tinkle. Uh, I mean, hey, Tingle is, um, you know, a character that grows on you sometimes, but not really. Uh, but yeah, um, next time, next time we, uh, we, we boat around a little bit. We look around, we, we, we do things, and uh, yeah. Uh, what are you guys saying right now? What are you doing? Uh, it's a place you should be seeking out. Oh yeah, actually. So where I need to go is east. Okay, good to know. Cool. Got it. All right. So yeah, next time we're going east. So <laughs> yeah, uh, been been way longer than I normally record. So yeah, that's why I'm kind of like not saying words good at this point. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but hey, we uh we 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 still be a Finally, on, on the road to 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 the place, and we uh, we got a boat, we got a sail, we can uh, we can ride in the boat and sail around like you, like you do in this game. That's, that's the whole thing about the game is you gotta get a boat and sail around in the sea. Yeah. <laughs> so that's it. That's it. <laughs> I I don't have anything else to say. Um, so bye.